I don't know about you guys, but when I first saw this line, I was new to the hobby, I saw it on an angelfish, and I, I was bummed out. I thought it was because I had somehow damaged it, or maybe when it was a fry, it had been attacked, or something had happened, basically. And I never really paid attention to it until I began to notice it on other fish. Then I just kind of assumed that it was, you know, part of the natural formation of the scales or whatever, and I never really thought too much of it. But once a week, I take a freshwater fish book and kind of read through it, learn a little bit more about fish that I keep. And I was reading this aquarium owner's guide by Gina Sanford from 1999, oldie but goodie. And it actually came up. It turns out that this line is a series of pores that are connected to a nerve system, which of course link to the brain. And what it does is it takes in water and it allows the fish to analyze it and detect any disturbances it might have. This lets your fish know if maybe there's food or predator. It also helps them navigate through water. It's actually really important for the fish. And I just thought this was pretty cool and now I know and now you know. And anyways, I hope this was informative. And if you have any questions about your aquarium or fish, you know what to do. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Gus and this is my aquarium info.